Alright guys, so welcome back to my channel and again here is another daily review and the daily that I'm going to show you guys for today is this one this is my Delia Bahama apricot look at that look at that it's so beautiful and obviously it's also proliferous look at that here's the first uh, flower and let me just remove this one so what I love about this data guys is first of all the color combination and as you can see it's a combination of apricot and white color so there is like white tip from its petals as you can see guys and this one looks uh, to be just pure orange but some of them were like with white tips look at that it's so beautiful it's just that um today i was expecting that it's gonna rain look at that it's a bit cloudy actually here and i was expecting that it's gonna rain so i haven't watered them since morning that's why it's kind of looking a bit sad but um anyway guys this dahlia is something that i can really recommend you if you are the type of person who's creating like a color theme in your garden if you want something orangey with a bit of white and maybe a little bit of yellow as well because if you're going to look at it there's also a part of it that kind of looks like yellow color and then at the center it becomes more of like apricot orange color something like that and the size of this flower is, um, let me just get the tape measure for you. Just getting my tape measure inside my pocket. There you go. And let's start to measure the flower now. So I think this is the oldest flower. So let's see what's the size of this one. Mm -hmm. So this one is like eight centimeter guys it's eight centimeter and let's check the other blooms mm -hmm. this one is like um, this one is also eight centimeter and I think it's probably consistent to be eight centimeter this one it looks a bit bigger this is probably eight and a half yeah, so around that uh, size for the flower, 8 cm diameter. And for the height of this plant, let me just check. Okay, so I already put it on the top of the bucket. So it's like almost 70, so let's say 68, 70 cm. So yeah, that's the size of uh, this plant. And as mentioned guys, uh, in my previous um, videos, most of my dahlias are planted in the bucket. So I assume that it can grow it can grow bigger if it has been planted probably in the ground directly instead of uh, the bucket. or maybe if it has been planted like my karma lagoon in a bigger uh, pot like this one which is 42 by 42 centimeter 42 centimeter diameter and 42 centimeter height and look at that this one is also doing well and just like my karma lagoon this one is also having a flower direction that is facing upwards but maybe a little bit of maybe um 80 70s uh, degree something like that but some of the flowers are really facing upwards like this one that is just about to bloom so it's really really beautiful guys look at that flower so if you are looking to uh, buy something like this um, if I'm not mistaken this one is imported it's not originally from here in New Zealand um, I think this was imported from US or Europe I'm not so sure but anyway guys if you are looking to um, have something like this with orangey white and yellow color combination then this is the one to have 
and I also took some photos of uh, this dahlia just uh, to show you guys and I hope you like it. Alright, so those were the photos of this dahlias. And if you guys have any questions or any comments about this dahlias or anything that you would like to know, please write down your comments in the comment section or any questions in the comment down in the comment section and I will be happy to answer all your inquiries about this dahlias. Alright guys, so thank you very much and I hope you have considered subscribing to my channel if you would like to see more of my daily updates. And definitely, I will give you some more updates of uh, all my dahlias here in our garden in general. Oh, by the way, um, I just noticed this one that I have. This is actually my dahlia from seed and looks like it's doing well in this area. Alright guys, so I will see you again on my next one. Thank you very much and bye for now.